So millions of viewers tuned in to watch Rihanna's high-flying Super Bowl halftime performance. Her show revealed more than just her talent. Yeah, it revealed her baby bump. We didn't know about that until then. So staying active during pregnancy positively affects a woman's health. We got Dr. Katherine Gercek, OBGYN at Alina Health this morning to talk all about pregnancy and exercise. Dr. Gercek, thanks for being with us today. Thanks for having me this morning. Okay, first of all, and this is a bit of a rhetorical question, but did you enjoy Rihanna's performance? Well, I thought it was actually really exciting to see how much energy she had on stage. Mm -hmm. For sure. And so as an OBGYN, what do you think of the halftime performance, the level of activity, that sort of thing? Yeah, I thought it was really exciting to see someone pregnant and on that really grand stage showing women that you can stay active during pregnancy and it's healthy to do that. And talk to us why that is, uh, why it's healthy to continue, whether it's walking or maybe running or, or any or really any sort of exercise. Well, it has a bunch of benefits in pregnancy. Um, for example, it's great for stress relief. It's great for maintaining weight gain at it or weight inappropriate weight gain. It's also great for maintaining blood sugar and overall just in a level of fitness that allows women to stay healthy throughout their pregnancy. And what are some of the kinds of exercises you can do during pregnancy? You can usually maintain a lot of what you've already been doing. So things like walking, hiking, people who are running, continue running, some weightlifting, yoga, swimming, um, but obviously thinking about some of the restrictions that might apply during pregnancy as well. Mm -hmm. Dr. Gercek, I remember I, I have friends that, you know, ran all the way up to, you know, I feel like they ran to the hospital. Uh, <laughs> for me, I, I think around six or seven months, I, I was, I just said, I can't, I can't do this anymore. I can't run. I would start walking and I figured that that was sort of better than, than other things to do. Are there exercises you should not be doing? Yeah, I get that question a lot. I think things like being on a bicycle that's not stationary, your center of gravity changes a lot in pregnancy, making it dangerous. Or, you know, contact sports, things where you might have a ball. So, for example, volleyball, I get, people ask me if they can continue it. I would say no way. You may get hit with the ball. You may run into someone. It can, that can be dangerous. Mm -hmm. So are there any reasons to not exercise during pregnancy? Yeah, each pregnancy is going to be very individual, right? And so some of the reasons you may not want to exercise during pregnancy would be restrictions from your doctor, or if you had a high-risk pregnancy, things like preterm labor, preeclampsia, um, uh, placental problems that can cause women to need to be restricted in pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Or if you're just really tired, really, really, really tired. I mean, <laughs> so don't feel bad if you didn't get your walk in today. You, it, you'll be just fine. <laughs> Give yourself some grace. Yes. <laughs> Dr. Gertrude, thanks for being with us today. We appreciate your time. You're welcome. Thank mm -hmm. you.